Hey everybody, it's Chris and Desha. I'm Chris. And I'm Des. And today we're going to talk to you about Stan and Ollie, a movie about Laurel and Hardy starring John C. Riley and Stephen Coogan. Des, what did right. you think? I loved this movie. First of all, it's set in uh, the 40s or wherever, 50s, and I just love, I love that era. Me too. I love Me too. movies of that era. I love the music of that era. It's what I, if, if given the choice, that is what I will listen to, is big band music of that era. So I, uh, I can't say that I love Stan and like uh, Laurel and Hardy. I can't, I don't know that I have ever actually seen a full mm -hmm. Laurel and Hardy movie, but I know who they are. I know of them. They're they're of the Charlie Chaplin kind of age of comedy and physical comedy and smart comedy. I think, and this was uh, about the end of their career, and they're going on tour in Europe and. England and Ireland and around those areas and they're trying to kind of make some money so maybe they put on another movie or something like that and so they're kind of at the end of their their time so but this movie is so good partly because of how authentic it is about their comedy and what was funny mm -hmm. and how they performed and what they did i thought it was so precious and their relationship with each other stop it <laughs> it was so good i could not recommend more going and seeing this movie you're gonna it's, it's so good i really loved it what did you think? totally agree uh, it was so good sorry was, some people are screaming yeah uh but i <laughs> Really, really enjoyed it too. Like I love John C. Riley. I love Stephen Coogan. I love both their wives, Shirley Henderson and Nina Arianda. I guess uh, they were both fantastic. And it really just you just needed the four of them really in it. But uh, it was really a well-made movie about these people and their relationship and how it really was a business relationship that. Just because they'd worked together for so long turned into something else and Friendship. then yeah. something nice and sweet and there's a scene at the end where they're the bed oh, uh, and what i loved about it what was so smart is that they reenacted so many of their funny bits in it and so you really i was it's, laughing it's out loud so at the good. funny it's like so cute. Funny. uh they like, did them well like yes. it's a really it's not they must have watched really them tell it's john c Riley and right. this guy because uh, I saw some kind of interview with uh, the guy who played Laurel. Stephen Coogan. Yeah. And he's like, I had to do this movie because I didn't want anybody else to play this part. I, I loved, loved it I so loved much. And that, that's, that's, it came across. They're both fantastic. The writing's really good. The directing's really good. And it is beautiful to look at. Yeah, it is great. It's I love really the way they film nice. movies like this in that time era. And I love that it starts off like in, I think, with the 30s and they're really, really popular yeah. for a second. Yeah. Then it goes to... The 40s, where they're ending kind of their relationship together, and then in the 50s again yeah, is most of the movie where they come back together. Yeah. And now it's like our last hurrah. We got to make some money because we're not as famous anymore, and that kind of stuff. And just what unravels with their relationship and with them. And it's really it's good. So good. Yeah. Really, I hope that's what the relationship was really like. <laughs> I, know. I know it's never 100% with the movie, but I hope well, it's based on a book. I think. Yeah, a book. Yeah, but yeah. hopefully, hopefully. But it was really good. I so enjoyed it. So go see it. It's nice and happy and enjoyable. Good Yay. job. Good job. Yay. <laughs>